What's going on, heroes from the internet? I'm Variety Gamer 95 back for some more Kirby Space Squad refresh. <clears throat> so last time we took care of level 6, Ice Island. We actually beat the leader of the Squeaks, but Kirby's treasure chest was stolen by Meta Knight. <clears throat> this time we're gonna be moving on to level 7. The Secret Sea. So I cannot say that. I was expecting Meta Knight to make an appearance in this game, of all games of the Kirby series. Like, he appeared in Squeak Squad, but not Triple Deluxe? Are you serious? Man, I don't know what's up with that. You know, I'm gonna give it a Tornado because I really don't need it. <clears throat> so yeah, as you just heard, the ability to start vanish because this game actually follows the Amazing Mirror rules when it comes to copy abilities. You know what, I think all that's over here is just a cutter bubble. Hold on. I can inhale that. There we go. Inhale it. Because that switch closes pretty qu pretty fast. Okay, okay all that for a one-up. Seriously. Whatever. Um, I guess I could take it, sure. Not that it's ever really necessary. I mean, I have plenty of lives. And this is also Kirby. I'm going to go ahead and give it a cutter because I don't need it. Yeah, that's what I was anticipating, my getting hit. Because even though this game has an continuous health bar, you still lose your copy ability in only one hit. It's the only Kirby game with a continuous vitality bar that's like that. First chest is up there, so we need to be careful here. <clears throat> Swim up here. And that's the first chest of three gotten. Okay. Now, I remember there is a treasure chest, I believe, in this level that requires fire. So, hopefully, I can have a fire ability bubble just so I'm ready for it, you know? <clears throat> I felt like I've already replayed. Come on, really? I felt like I've already uh, replayed enough levels. And I'm looking to get through this as fast as I can. <clears throat> Sorry, I keep clearing my throat. I just had lunch. Seems to be a recurring trend here. Hehe. <laughs> I was recording right after eating lunch. Alright. Oh, is this the level that I think it is? Hold on, because if it's what I think it is... Oh, that was lucky. Because if, if this is the level I think it is... Oh no, this is a different level, okay. So we need to take fire here. Speaking of having the fire ability bubble. Now watch it, because he might jump. Right, rush him. Okay, I have no idea how that didn't touch me, but that didn't. <clears throat> Alright, that's uh, all we just gotten. Oh, you know what? I think I know where I can actually keep a fire ability bubble. Let's see, Secret Sense, White Spray Paint, and the Throw Scroll. Hold on. Uh, I was saying before, I might have an idea where I can find a fire ability bubble. I think that was one of the copy abilities for DeRoach. Yes, it is! Okay. So I'm gonna go ahead and take this fire bubble and keep, just keep it with me. And just because I want to be prepared for that one time. And you know how frustrated Kirby could be. Hey, look, we're running on the Warp Star. That doesn't happen too often in this game. Oh! Okay, this is actually the level that I was thinking of before. Yes. This is actually where you need metal. Damn, it was this late in the game? I thought it was far earlier than that. Okay, just as long as you do not tap down B, you'll be safe. You'll be able to get this chest. Because, because Metal Kirby is so, so heavy, he won't be pushed by the wind, see? And you just won't be able to get that chest otherwise. <clears throat> so, damn, that was actually way later than I thought. Okay, let's inhale this wheelie here. I guess I don't need Tornado anymore. Yeah, so we're going to be able to... Uh, turn to Fire Wheel Kirby. And burn through the clouds. Nice. Just a 1-up. Okay, whatever. It's a 1-up in a Kirby game. I mean, I guess Kirby games don't usually save your life count. Not really the copy player that I want for this guy. Like I said, he is incredibly annoying to fight without a copy ability. Although, I guess I should be lucky that... There he goes. I guess I should be lucky that... I had a copy ability at all. I should be lucky that I don't have to worry about wasting fire. 
Even though... Oh. Speaking of fire, the sword scroll that we got. So let us mix sword and fire. And we get something interesting. This is the fire sword cut. Can't be used in water. So this is actually what the, the sword ability scroll does. It allows you to combine sword with fire, ice, or spark. To get fire sword, ice sword, and thunder sword. So I think this was a... No, this wasn't the level where I needed fire, was it? Oh yeah, um, whatever you do, do not press up and B here. If you have the fire sword. Because there's nothing but death down there. Is this the level that I would have needed fire? Holy crap, it is! And I came prepared. I didn't even remember this was the level that I needed it. Okay, well, now that I got that fear over with, I don't have to worry about keeping the fire bubble anymore. Alright, sapphire spray paint, graphic piece, and another part of the ghost metal. Okay, well, now that that irrational fear is over and done with, let's move on. Oh boy. Oh yeah, I don't need this. I'll keep it, actually. Because, you know what? I think we're going to need some sort of fa fire ability coming up. Hold on. Trying to be careful here. Well, there, there's a hothead down there anyway. So we need fire so we can grab this chest. Okay, I believe there's... Yeah, there are all platforms here, so nothing to worry about. You know what? I don't believe I'm going to need this. Hold on. I think it's being that we need to get this next chest. Hold on. Yes, it is. Okay. So we've got to be quick here. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and inhale it because... Yep. That platform is going to fall and screw you out of your chest. Okay, they're giving us animal, which... Do we need animal for anything? I think it's actually just for a one-up. Obviously, it's not going to be for a big chest. Oh, is this the level that I'm thinking of? Yes, it is. So, Spinny here is the only one of the main members of the Squeaks known to have the ability to swim. Pretty interesting. And despite being effectively being a mid-boss, we can actually hurt him with our water gun. I was not expecting that, good sir. Or ma'am, whatever gender you are. I don't know. Mix, I guess. MX. Alright, graphic piece. Spunky notes and the bomb scroll. The bomb scroll basically does the same thing with sword, except it only works with ice and spark. There's no fire bomb. Which, I mean, fire bombs are a thing. Why couldn't they make it work? You could argue that the, the bomb explosion is already fire, but. You know what? I don't remember if Bomb can actually light fuses. <clears throat> Has Bomb ever been able to light fuses in the Kirby series? I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of these blippers. I believe we have to be careful here. Okay, so I'm not gonna equip sword yet. If you take one of the uh, elemental swords underwater, it'll just turn into a normal sword. That's it. I think we want to be careful here. Let me see here. Come on. Okay. Okay, it's fine. I already got it. Whatever, I was gonna get rid of sword anyway. My thumb was already reaching for the X button, so I don't care. Can't get it back regardless, so... Now that I got in that chest, let's go ahead and get a move on. Watch out for this glunk here, because, yep, he's going to shoot. See, now normally this would be another race. We could just do this. Get rid of this stupid blipper. I'm going to use his M tomato. Just to free up inventory space. Okay. Ah, great. I don't remember which one to take. Or maybe this is one of the ones where it doesn't matter. Oh, no, it doesn't matter. Okay, it's all good. Wow, so look at this sunken ship, huh? So one of the... <clears throat> one of the levels here is a bit of a maze. 
So I am probably going to end up having to replay that one. Yeah, so the sparks actually go on top of the water. Which you think it actually electrify the water, you know, make it an electrified bathtub. Hey, I wasn't even trying to do that. Cherries, whatever, I don't need it. Ah, yeah, yeah. We can duck through here, use spark. Okay, there's the second chest. Get out of here, heavy knight. There we go. A lot of chips, brown and birds, and a wild dew. There we go, that's what I was trying to do before. Okay. So I believe the next the third Okay. This level. So we grabbed the big chest, but none of the main members of the squeaks actually made an appearance. This is the one level where you only fight the squeakers, not any of the main members. Okay, so now we have to find the correct door. Which is going to be up here. Yep. Oh, that went fast. Okay, that's all three chests gotten. Nice. Alright, spray paint ocean, the magic scroll, and the secret door key for level 7. So, Silver 5 is the short course, the last short course of the game. This is the level that I was thinking of before. Okay. So, we're fighting Boxy here. That was not what I wanted to do. What I wanted to do was this. I thought that I was going to actually hit him. Okay, I heard that sound, and I keep thinking that uh, it's because Kirby's health is low. This is not an ideal copy ability. Let's see, he should release another box. Boxy, yeah, he's kind of annoying to fight without a copy ability because you have to wait for him to unleash an attack. The magic scroll actually allows Kirby to use magic's original ability for the amazing mirror if you press and hold B. Let's see, if, if there's an enemy that I could demonstrate with that, then I'd like to do it. I'd like to show it off. Uh, not exactly what I had in mind. Gotta watch Box Boxer. Ay ay ay. It's so slow, but I obviously don't want him grabbing me. Okay, come on, pal. Are you gonna move or what? That's what I'm waiting for you to do. Let me see here. So press B. Well, the gist of it is that all the bills and screen is supposed to turn into food. And yeah, that actually gets rid of magic. So. You've been warned about that. Let me see. I think this is the only Kirby game with uh, big blocks. I'm thinking of Superstar for some reason. This is the only Kirby game with big blocks where you can actually bop through with Kirby's head. Am I seriously going to get only get the big... Okay. Well, I got one of the chests. <clears throat> Store is going to try to grab that one. Oh my lord. Get out of here, Heavy Knight. Force you to drop it. I like some food. Let's just get out. I gotta replay the level anyway. That's two of the three chests. Gotta go back to the last one. Right. Graphic piece and another vitality heart. So one last vitality heart to find. <clears throat> so don't go in the middle, apparently. Eh, whatever. It's just a one up. See, you think it is the right door to go through? Just the one up. Or maybe it was the middle. Okay. It's gonna be facing bonkers here. I don't remember if we'll need hammer, but I guess I'll take it. <clears throat> oh, are you serious? Yeah, I was supposed to go in the middle path. Okay. <clears throat> Okay, I already win this one. So take the middle. Okay, yeah, they trick you if you want to get that one up. Let me see here. Okay, yeah. So what you're meant to do here is find the correct switch. But I'm smarter than that. And I'm using cheese strats. But if you must know, the correct answer is the top switch. Alright, very nice. 
<clears throat> so since I do not need that chest, I can just go ahead and let Storm make off with it. Alright, that's the level cleared. That honestly didn't take as long as I remembered. Wow. Alright, secret map piece. <clears throat> And I th if I remember this level correctly, yeah, we need wheel. Okay. So we have to race for a big chest. So this is pretty fast. You're likely going to be trying this one again. I say that, then I actually did it in a one try. I can't believe it. Alright, and that's actually Secret C. Wow, listen to 20 minutes, and I'm already at the boss. Alright, chocolate spray paint. Whatever you do, do not go to the boss immediately. Haul your ass back to a level that has Tornado as one of the offerings. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna go ahead and grab a second Tornado Bubble. I'm gonna go ahead and take it. Okay, so... Meta Knight in this game is a damn dirty, no good cheater. He means serious business this time around. Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and take my tornado here. And let's fight. If you've played this game, then you know exactly what I need. Look, see? Now remember that tornado is broken beyond belief. Look, I hit him twice and he just blocked both attacks. Okay, and the stars that Meta Knight produces will give sword. You notice he didn't offer us one. Okay. And Meta Knight's ship, the Halberd, is actually uh, flying into space. So if we stand here and don't get the chest, we can see that the Halberd is actually lifting off into the galaxy. There we go. So are we going to be heading to space in a little bit? Interesting. Just in case the recording fails, I took the liberty of creating a restore point. Because there's another un unviewable cutscene after this. Let's claim our prize. Or collect our prize. Yeah, it's a claim. Which, you know, it's the boss battle badge. <clears throat> Midnight has been defeated. Pfft, you don't say. The chest holding the strawberry shortcake is at hand. Kirby approaches the chest to rescue his delicious snack. But as we all know, it can never be that simple. Because it's the squeaks, they followed Kirby. Looks like he's saying top of the morning to you, doesn't it? Come on, he's got the perfect stance, the top hat and everything. And now they're still in the treasure chest. Without hesitation, the squeaks open the chest. Oh, Kirby's cake. But there's no cake in the chest, only a dark, eerie cloud of smoke. The smoke envelops the squeaks and disappears into space. I don't know, it looks like it just took over Daroche's body. I wonder if there's a translation error. How awful! At this rate, the strawberry shortcake will be lost forever. Oh, and I guess Popstar could possibly be destroyed as well. That's important too. Gerber must find the cake and solve the mystery of the creepy smoke. And so he departs for the stars.
All right, so now we're going to be moving on to the galaxy in the next episode, of course.